Selena Gomez covers GQ and doesn't give an F about having a normal childhood, Dolce & Gabbana refrigerators, and more today on. I'm off to Vegas right after this for the Independence Day movie. Junket, how's your weekend shaping up? Selena Gomez has taken over GQ Magazine, aka she's on the cover, and there's a cover story coming tomorrow, but she's given us a sneak peek of it, and in this behind the scenes video, she's taken on the country. Bam, there's a dock, a barn, all in bikinis, and she looks smoking hot. Take a look. Inside the mag, she's gonna talk about what it was like to go to high school, basically on the Disney lot, and now become a real young adult woman. The teaser quote that GQ has given us says, I didn't have an opportunity to figure out my life without people having an opinion every step of the way, Selena said, but she didn't really have any self-pity. I chose this, so I'm not gonna sit here and say, oh my God, poor me, I didn't have a normal childhood. I don't give a fuck about that. Bleep. <laughs> Safe to say this girl is all grown up and really comfortable with her sexuality, which I love. And it seems like her head's in the right place, so I can't fault her. Selena's not backing down no matter what anyone says about her new sexy image. Weird is king. Dolce & Gabbana makes refrigerators now. Oh, but only a hundred. One of a kind, limited edition, hand painted. For $34,000, you can have one. They teamed up with Smeg for these colorful beauties painted by Sicilian artists. So really, it's more like a piece of art than a refrigerator. Miley Cyrus and Liam Hemsworth have made their first appearance since being a couple 2.0 non-official appearance because they snuck around and tried to hide at the Huntsman movie premiere last night. So Liam's brother Chris is in the movie so no doubt they wanted to support him in Westwood at the Regency Village Theater. And they didn't walk the red carpet because they were trying to keep a low profile. But one fan asked both of them for a photo. So we have this. I don't know, maybe you just shouldn't go. I'm sure you could have gotten a screener of the movie and watched it at home if you didn't want to be photographed together. Today's shout out is for special someone, Clay Bryce. You comment every day and I really appreciate it and I notice it even if I don't always comment back. Better believe I'm watching you. So you said on the last episode of Be Your Selfie, awesome episode today, Missy. Love watching Be Your Selfie every week. And thank you for tweeting me and supporting so much. I really, really appreciate it. You guys have an amazing weekend. Make sure you're subscribed, then have an amazing weekend and I'll see you guys on Tuesday. The one and only Niall DeMarco. We were hanging out we were talking about how important accessibility is, and y'all know that I captioned my videos, I think it's really important for everyone.